Hey guys, in this video, I will be showing you how to do a very cool effect just like this. So, you see it, you can make an image, track your subject, and we are going to show you how to do, do this in Fusion. So, first of all, I'm going to show you what I did. So, I put in Media Pool, add Media, so I had Media 1, then I took from my Media Pool this light bulb thing. And then I'm going to show you all how to do it, and then I use these stuff. So, I'm going to, going to delete this all, and then I'm going to do it all over again. So, you just want to go like that, this is how you're going to start. So, first of all, you're going to want to press here to add a merge node. Now, you just want to keep that here on the side. Perfect. Now, make sure this is selected and press Control spacebar. Then, over here, all you're going to want to do is to right here pl and then hopefully planner tracker okay so then add now in here and you can just press on that to make that big like this okay select all of this whatever that part that part bring it upper okay and then here, all we're going to want to do is go here and build our thing around the subject. So just build a good mask around the subject that you want to be tracking. Needs to be somewhat exact, but don't worry, this is just for tracking purposes. And then all you need to do is make sure they have planet tracker on. And then all you're going to want to do is go here, after wait, and turn it into a hybrid point area, just like to do that on perspective, sure, and you're going to want to track code, make sure they're on frame zero, first of all, for the start, now it's just going to go around like that, and there we have it, so, what we're going to want to do is create planet transform, that's going to create that, and if you can't find it, just do control, and then scroll in and scroll out to find everything. Now we can um, select this and press shift and then let go in there. We can now take that out, go like that, sorry, um, put this back into the merge. Okay, so this pan planner transform is not what we want. Okay, we have your media one and two media one out. So let's just go like this and I do not see Oh here. Let's just Oh oopsie. You wanna make sure that this is on the yellow one. Okay, now we're back. Um planet transform now you want to get on um, your media pool, your image. For me, it's this little light bulb. And first of all, you can stick it in straight through the client transform and then that to here, and then you're gonna have that. Now, what I like to do first of all is to do a transform node. So, do that control spacebar, just write T R A, and then maybe an M. Sorry, not an M. <laughs> Oopsie, um, transform with an N, so just transform normally. Add, add it, and then just size it down. That's a very easy way. Now you can see it's already tracked, so it's gonna move around like we want it to. But that's not what we wanted this big with thing with white background. We want it to look more like a light bulb. So what we're gonna do is add here. We're gonna do Control Spacebar and press key, like right key, sorry, then Delta key here. And delta here, all we're gonna do is find the color that we want over there. I like to put it on yellow because yellow is what we're looking for, and we got it. So now delta here is done. Then we have our transform, and in transform, you can actually move it up here, whatever you want. I like it to look something more like this. Okay. And now we can just look through.
Okay, so you saw it there. That's how you do it. If you have any questions, just leave a comment.